सी आई ई टी एन सी ई आर टी प्रेजेंट ऑडियो बुक संतूर टेक्स्ट बुक ऑफ इंग्लिश फॉर क्लास थ्री चैप्टर सिक्स पेपर बोर्ड्स पेज नंबर फिफ्टी सिक्स लेट एस रीड मीना वॉक्ड टूवर्ड्स द स्ट्रीम नियर द बैम्बू ब्रिज शी बेंट अ लिटल एंड पुट अ पेपर बोट इन द वॉटर it sailed down the stream swiftly meena was delighted she went on putting several paper boats in the stream page number 57 as the boats floated down the stream she saw a naughty boy pushing the boats into the water meena stared at the boy angrily he did not care for meena's angry face she shouted stop but the boy did not stop why are you overturning the paper boats meena asked angrily because it is fun replied the boy it may be fun for you but those are my paper boats said meena so you just stop overturning my boat the boy thought for a minute and said i will not do it again but i also want to play can you help me meena said i have enough paper you can make boats for yourself page number 58 The boy answered, "I don't know how to fold the paper to make boats." Meena said, "That's easy. I will help you." She showed him how to make the boats. Meena took out colored paper of different sizes. She showed the boy how to fold and refold the paper to make a boat. The boy watched carefully then he took a piece of paper and started to make a paper boat soon a few boats were ready meena gently put her boats in the stream the boy put his boats in the stream too the boats sailed down the stream both enjoyed watching the boats new words delighted several overturning stream watched a answer the following one what was meena playing with fill in the blank page number 59 let us think two Meena was angry. Why? Fill in the blank. Three. How did Meena help the boy? Fill in the blank. B. Think an answer. One. Meena made paper boats. What else can you make with paper? Discuss in small groups. Two. What games do you play with your friends? Which one do you like the most? Why? C. Say whether true or false. One. The boy thought it was fun to overturn paper boats. Two. Meena ran home to complain about the boy. Three. The boy did not know how to make paper boats. Four, Meena had only white paper. Page number sixty. Let us speak. Look at the pictures. Tell the story of Manish saves the ant to the class. In picture one. Manish is shown walking in picture 
Manish is shown watching a drowning ant in the river. In picture 3, Manish is shown making a paper boat and floating it towards the ant. In picture 5, the ant is shown boarding the paper boat. In picture 6, Manish is shown pulling out the paper boat with the ant on board. In picture 6, Manish is shown releasing the ant onto the ground and walking away. Note to the teacher, give a help box according to the level of learners. Provide support to the learners as and when needed. Page number 61 Let us learn. Read the following sentences. Observe the underlined words. Example 1 Meena walked towards the stream near the bamboo bridge. She bent a little and launched a paper boat. In the second sentence, she is used instead of Meena. Example 2. The boy jumped into the stream and pulled the boat out. He gave it to Meena. In the second sentence, he is used instead of the word boy. E. Fill in the blanks using he or she. 1. Rani likes playing outside. Blank likes flying kites. 2. Sahil has a top. Blank plays with it every day. 3. Durga is five years old. Blank is going to school. 4. Ranjit goes to school regularly. Blank likes reading stories. Note to the teacher. Draw learner's attention to the use of he and she in the texts covered in units 1 and 2. Encourage students to create and share sentences using he and she. Page number 62 B. Look at the picture. Write where each thing is. Choose the correct word from the brackets. 1. The bat is, fill in the blank, on or under the bed. 2. The bag is, fill in the blank, in or on the chair. 3. The ball is, fill in the blank, in or under the box. 4. The car is, fill in the blank, in or under the table. 5. The books are, fill in the blank, in or on the shelves. Note to the teacher. Reinforce the concept of preposition by adding examples from the learner's milieu. Page number 63 Let us do A. Follow the steps to draw a rangoli. Step 1 Step 2 Step 3 Step 4 Step 5 Step 6 Now make a rangoli by connecting the dots given below. Note to the teacher, help students recall the Rangoli activity given on the page 26 of Mridang 2. Page number 64 A. 
write a few lines about the picture using the following clues. Park, children, playing, seesaw, swings, slide, enjoying, happy. Note to the teacher. Encourage learners to share their sentences in the class. Page number 65 B. Solve the crossword puzzle. Hint. All the answers are related to toys and games. There are two headings given in the bottom of this page. Across and down. Under the heading across, number two is a round object that spins on a needle. Number three, an object used to hit a ball. Number four, a round glass ball used for playing. Under the title down, the following are written. One, a game played using a ball and your foot. 3. A round object used to play. 5. A seat tied by ropes and which moves front and back. Page number 66 Let us explore. A. Talk to your elders at home. Find out what games they played when they were young. Learn a game from them and share with your friends, preferably in small groups. Page number 67 Self-Assessment 1. I can recite the poems in a group, in pairs, by repeating after my teacher, by myself. Tick or cross in the boxes given in front of these options. 2. I can read the stories by myself, with my classmates, with the help of my teacher. Write tick or cross in the boxes given in front of these options. 3. I can write by copying from the book or the board as my teacher speaks with the help of my classmates by myself. Write tick or cross in the boxes given in front of these options. 4. I can tell the stories that I have read or listened by myself without any help with the help of the teacher, by using the book. Write correct or cross in the boxes given in front of these options. 5. I was able to do all the exercise questions, most of the exercise questions, a few exercise questions. Write correct or wrong in the boxes given in front of all these options. Note to the teacher, the assessment sheet can be filled by the student under the guidance of parents and teachers. Santur, you were just listening to this audiobook, the textbook of English for class 3. Narration, Babla Kocher and Bamta Malkani. Technical coordination, Bati Langlingdo. Sound recordist, Mayank Kumar. Assistance in production, Soumya Malik. Directed and produced by Vimlesh Chaudhary. This audiobook is presented to you by CIET and CERT, New Delhi, India.